Vem Magalenha Rojão, traz a lenha pro fogão, vem fazer armação. Hoje é um dia de... Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be sharing with you my top 12 Sinfo Color Cream Nail Polishes. I'm not going to share any of my glitters and I'm not going to share any of my um, iridescence and, or anything like that. These are going to be all cream nail polishes. These are my favorite. I feel like they are my top 12. These are the ones that I have been using consistently throughout the year that I reach for all the time. And um, the bottles are a little bit messy because like I said, they are well-loved nail polishes. But I wanted to share these absolutely gorgeous colors with you. Now if you don't know, Sinful Colors is under the umbrella or produced or made by Revlon. Revlon cosmetics are fabulous. Their nail polishes are just some of the best drugstore nail polishes. But what's amazing about Sinful Colors, if you do not own any Sinful Colors, I don't know where you've been, but these nail polishes are very inexpensive. Now they have two brands. They have the regular Sinful Color nail polishes and then they also have the Sinful Shine. I am a huge collector of Sinful nail polishes um, because I think that the collections they put out are just beautiful and the quality is superb truly 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 you're not missing out they do not scamp on the quality of their nail polishes now in the intro of this video you saw like my alex drawers and i picked those up from ikea everybody in the world on youtube houses their makeup in them and they actually are a very nice beautiful way to store a ton of product and have it completely put away and organized so yeah you're gonna hear the kids running around they're playing and watching TV and just being you know being wild and free while I'm busy doing this so they're entertaining themselves right now um, so in that bottom drawer that you saw that is where I hold all of my sinful color nail polishes I have about a hundred and 60 bottles 150 to 160 bottles and I have a few that have spilled over about 10 or 20 that have spilled over into another drawer and that is because um, the drawer actually only holds like 140 nail polishes but I absolutely adore the way my nail polishes are stored they're easy to find I keep them color coordinated now I only keep my sinful color nail polishes color coordinated and I don't rotate them uh, as far as the seasons are concerned because um, the collection is so extensive it's just too massive to do that so yeah so let's get right to the video I hope you guys enjoy um, these are the colors that I'm going to be sharing with you so let's get started so the first nail polish I want to share with you is a 1218 Banana Appeal. Now this, the reason why this is my favorite yellow nail polish is because yellow nail polishes I find are very, very difficult um, as far as the coverage is concerned and the opaqueness of the nail polish. And this particular one from the Gel Tech line from Simple Colors is opaque, creamy, and absolutely gorgeous. The cover the coverage is amazing so that's why this yellow is my favorite yellow so this is a close-up of 1218 banana appeal by sinful colors and it's from their gel tech line and then right here is the yellow and all of my swatches that I'm showing you only have two coats of nail polish and the coverage is excellent okay so the next color I want to share with you is this absolutely gorgeous orange. This is a beautiful, beautiful orange. And the name of this is 1123 Citrine. And why this nail polish is my favorite color is because whenever we go on vacation, I always like to have orange on my toes. Um, because orange just on my skin tone is so beautiful. And usually when we're doing like a quick little getaway, it's usually like to somewhere where there's a beach or my toes are going to be out so I really like this absolutely gorgeous orange and it looks so nice on my toes so here is a close-up of 1123 citrine and then right here is the orange and do you see the coverage you get and the shine is fabulous 
So the next color is this absolutely gorgeous red. I think that every girl needs a beautiful red. I have tons of red nail polish out of the Sinful Colors line. This is my favorite red. Now I do also own the Sinful Colors red from the Gel Tech line, but for some reason this particular one is my favorite out of the sinful colors. Now all my all time favorite red is for another video but if I had a choice in my sinful colors collection and I was going to line up all my reds this is the red that I would choose because it is so vibrant. It's like a rose red. It's beautiful and it's bright and it's very opaque and it's creamy. The shine on it is just fabulous. And the name of this red color is 957 Cross My Heart. So here is a close-up of 957 Cross My Heart in the bottle. And then right here is the swatch of Cross My Heart. So the next nail polish I want to share with you is my favorite pink out of my entire collection of nail polishes. Hands down, this is my favorite, favorite pink. It is number... 920 and the name of the nail polish is called 24 7. Oh my gosh this nail polish is just bright electric fun crazy crazy pigmented um, it is a matte it dries to a matte finish but even though it's matte I use a top coat that is shiny and no one ever knows that it's matte so here is a close-up of 920 24 7 this is a bright bright gorgeous pink it's my favorite pink and here it is right here swatched for you guys so this next nail polish is a more toned down pink I usually wear this pink nail polish when it's like um, spring or Easter time right in there is where when I like to reach for this pink and um, this pink I notice I always seem to put it on my toes and my hands at the same time it is this pink color here and it is number 1241 yours truly and it is from the gel tech line okay and this is what it looks like right here so here is a close-up of 1241 Yours Truly. And then here is a swatch of Yours Truly right there. So pretty. So the next color I want to share with you is a very soft purple, a lilac color nail polish. It's this one here. And the reason why this color is my favorite is because I usually wear this color on my toes and on my skin tone it almost looks white. But it's not quite white, white because it has that hint of purple in it and it's such a clean look on my toenails and I really really like that look because my feet need all the help they can get and this looks so pretty on my feet especially when I know that I'm going to be wearing a ton of sandals and it's going to be hot and my feet are going to be out I have to do things to make my feet look as attractive as possible because I don't have the prettiest feet in the world and here is a close-up of sweet tooth and, and then here is a swatch of sweet tooth right here okay so this next nail polish is this bright purple or I should say fuchsia color nail polish. Fuchsia on my skin tone looks absolutely gorgeous and I have to say that whenever I wear this nail polish I always feel fierce. Fierce! It just brings, makes me feel so good. I absolutely adore wearing this nail polish on my toes and on my hands. Um, and I actually pair it with a Orly nail polish that is like striped glitter nail polish that has the same kind of color to it. That's holographic. It is so gorgeous. So this is like my favorite nail polish whenever I'm going to do that kind of nail art design on my nails. I reach for this and... I absolutely adore the way this color makes me feel and it is Dream On 113 and it is a matte nail polish. Now I don't wear it in its natural state so I don't wear it mattified. I actually do put a top coat on top of it and it is popping. It is just so so beautiful. 
So here is a close up of Dream On. <laughs> and it is a matte. And here is the swatch for Dream On right there. Okay. The next nail polish is just a traditional blue. Whenever I think of a soft baby blue nail polish, I reach for this particular nail polish over all my other nail polishes, and it is Sale La Vie 1196. It looks like this. And so this nail polish is just gorgeous. So let me give you a close-up of this. So here is a close-up of Sale La Vie, and then right here is the swatch for Sale La Vie. So this NYX nail polish just is fierce. That's all I'm going to say. It is so beautiful during the day. It is electric and bright and beautiful and it's rich of color. And then in the evening, it's dark and deep and sensuous. It's just, just such a beautiful, beautiful blue. So here is a close-up of Endless Blue 1052 right here. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Did you hear me? Gorgeous. <laughs> And here is a swatch of Endless Blue right here. Okay. So the next nail polish I want to share with you is this one here. And I had to put this in this video. The reason why is because I bought this in a collection and I wasn't really thrilled with it. And then I wore it. And then I wore it again and I kept applying it. And I think I wore this nail polish for a month straight. And... I can't believe how gorgeous this nail polish is. It's really nothing special when you look at it here, but when you wear it, it's just so freaking beautiful. It is so gorgeous. So that is why I'm putting this into this video. This nail polish is just so beautiful. And it is my Bow Friend, B-U-O-Y-F-R-I-E-N-D. And it is number 1198. And I'll show you this up close. And here is a close-up of my bow friend. <laughs> and then right here is a swatch of my bow friend. And here is a close-up of Rise and Shine in the bottle, number 940. And then right here is a swatch of 940 Rise and Shine. And as you can see, this actually does not come off matte. It actually has a hint of um, shine to it. It is not as flat as what I would consider a matte nail polish. And on the bottom, so as you can see, like right here, it says matte and then it says Rise and Shine number 940. And yeah, it's not matte to me, but it's, it's claiming to be a matte, but nevertheless, it's an absolutely gorgeous nail polish. So last but not least, out of my top 12 nail polishes is absolutely gorgeous neutral nail polish. Now on me, I consider this to be a neutral because of my skin tone. On other or lighter skin tones, it might not be, but this is like my favorite neutral type of nail polish. It is like an understated sexy nail polish. It is so beautiful. You can rock this on your hands and your toes. It just is beautiful and classy and just timeless. And it is number 264 Vacation Time. It is my favorite, favorite out of my entire collection. This is my favorite. So on me, this nail polish really is a neutral. It is so gorgeous. I think it's so beautiful. So here it is up close in the bottle. So right here is a swatch of the nail polish. So I hope you guys enjoyed my favorite top 12 cream nail polishes by Sinful Colors. I have an abundance <laughs> of Sinful Color nail polishes. So when I tell you that these nail polishes are creamy, opaque, long lasting, long wearing, the shine is just amazing. I am not steering you wrong. These colors are absolutely gorgeous. So I hope you guys enjoyed my show and tell. 
of my favorite sinful color nail polishes and then I'm thinking that I might do each of my collections of nail polishes and show you some of my favorite through my other collections you guys let me know let me know if you're interested and would like to see my nail polish collection because I have really been considering doing a nail polish collection now I probably won't go through each color of my nail polishes I'll probably just show you my favorites or I'll just show you the collection in general and just show you how I um, store my nail polishes and how I organize them. You guys let me know because I'm interested and I want to know what you guys think. Um, yeah, so I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. I hope all of you are staying healthy, happy, and safe. Bye!